You know, guys, you bet on Battlefield, you're going to win most of the time. It's the game we play. Okay. Forward throw into up throw. And he's in the center stage. Nice turnaround pivot stuff. And going to just dash dance grab off the knockdown. And he's going to get him off the regular getup. And he's going to find the back air to send him off. And that's a neutral air. And good job getting the ledge. Not a great, not a ledge dash. But, you know, as Mango would say, it's almost as good. Ooh, he just, he thought he could get it. And I wonder if Metal Reaper could have done anything to counterattack that. Because, you know, generally as Mark, he's really, I mean, is anybody you don't want to overextend. And he definitely overextended it. All right, Shine, fortunately, first Mango sends him back that way. Although, not really fortunately. He meant to do that. But, uh, grab ledge. Oh, it doesn't get the tech chase. Yeah, I guess he was looking for a back air. I expect a forward smash out of that tech chase, to be honest. Does not get the DI. Please DI that. Looked a little, that little walk told me he was a little rattled after that, but maybe not. We'll see. Right back into it. Oh, and yeah, gets another grab. Forward throw. Not sure why. Maybe a uh, misinput. Maybe he just didn't think that he was going to get enough on the tech away on Battlefield platforms. Which, you know, I can respect. Oh, <laughs> sniff sharks him again. The runoff. Oh, just gets him to panic forward smash and says, I'll take another 45% off of that, thank you. Tries, to, yeah, he gets back, you know. Harder to react to, and he's just gonna hold ledge. Just gonna hold ledge. So, still, I mean, only a one stock deficit, and Fox can definitely do this. Although, Stango's pretty good at this matchup. Messed up his timing there on that one, it looks like. Ooh, okay, almost got the shine spike, because that was definitely not a perfect sweet spot for Mark. Oh, okay. I don't know what that jab was supposed to be, but... Oh, just charges in and gets caught by that classic counter to Marth. You know you know he's going to run in and grab. Just spot dodge it. And then do whatever you want. Okay. Grabs the ledge. You know, both these guys living on a nice edge with these stocks. And he's going to go out there. That's not a safe distance to up B from. And he'll just try to tack on a little more with lasers on his way down. That'll reaper well. Oh, uh, and he tries to just get the stock off, you know. Right, and he does. He does, to be fair to him. And he only takes 9%, but that was a big risk to take. I guess he was under a platform, so it's not as big a risk, but it's still a big risk to take. Don't take the risk. I am, though. Grabs him. Up air, up air. Nice job getting out of that. Although it might also have just been a messed up on spacing. Hard to tell for me, because I'm bad. Okay, and yeah, they just kind of looked at each other and said, we're going to dash dance, right? Yeah, let's go dash dance for a sec. Oh, it's game over. That's game over. A little smirk maybe from Sango, maybe not. You know, I would be happy after that. I'd be happy about that combo. It was good. It was nice. It was sick. It was slick. And we are going to switch to Captain Falcon. What's the ban? I would go final, to be honest. Oh, we're going back to Battlefield. Cool. Although I don't even know if they're, I assume, uh, winner's quarters, I assume they're still banned. I st assume this is semis will be when we start seeing best of five, but don't quote me on that because I'm not a tournament organizer, nor do I have, you know, an established rapport with them quite yet. Anyway, so far this isn't looking too different, uh, to be honest. It's just a matter of, yeah. Yeah, this isn't, it's not happening for him right now for our hero Metal Reaper. Nice down air though, and he gets the, he reacts to, to the roll in after that. You know what, Dr. Pills, I will take that because he's a good commentator. Anyway, uh, shouldn't be looking at chat. Up throw, forward tilt, okay. Not able to get too much. I mean, it's really, uh, you know, from my experience, it's kind of hard to get much off of uh, throws as Marth against Falcon, but that's a that's a death death combo for sure. And okay, I'm gonna roll behind and I'm just gonna throw him off stage. Uh, that's that's yeah, that's generally what you do. Four tilt, four tilt. Uh, okay. All right, nice, pretty good sweet spot. Don't know if that was perfect. Still just jump, but good job by Metal Reaper just going out there, no fear, saying you're not gonna up yet, so I'm gonna get you. Uh, I'm gonna get you, and here we go. Oh, just gets it, but nice up air to combo break that. No gentleman. 
up throw, tech chase, yeah, that's enough there. That's a couple, that's a third, but he doesn't get his ticker off that one. There's one, and again, he doesn't, and he gets that weird, just pops out of it right away. And, yeah, okay, not good, but he's just gonna up throw him, forward air, I mean, up air, up air. Should be a dead Marth, maybe, no, he doesn't get the ledge, ledge jump. Uh, yeah. Okay, good stuff, great stuff. Yeah, it's just not not really threatening enough space here from Falcon. He's not like putting pressure on Stango at all. I know he's scared <laughs> because I like obviously Stango you Stang on paper is the better player. But I feel like if you're not putting if you're not making him stuff your aerials or like at least dash dancing threaten some space alright, we're dead. Alright, cool. Thing. Okay, they're still sitting on the setup. No, they're rolling up. Okay, I was gonna say a little early to be the best out of five. So we are gonna move on. Yikes! We are gonna move on to probably another one of quarters. Maybe we'll get some losers on stream for you. Who knows? Lord have mercy on us. By the way, just looking at chat again. I guess it's between sets, so I can. Ultimate.